you're engaged. Uh, so what, you think I just go cheating on my fiancé all the time? No. No, of course I don't. Four years. I've been waiting for you for four years. And then I finally meet Jenny and you come back and fuck it all up. And ask you to wait for me. Oh, well that's okay then. Oh, Mark, what do you want me to say? That I regret going away? That I made a mistake? That, that I still love you? Do you? I didn't, I didn't mean to fuck things up for you. Sorry. My target was killed right by my side. I wouldn't really call that by the book. You didn't flinch. You didn't hesitate. You didn't panic. I've seen soldiers fall apart for less. Are you holding me here because I didn't break down and cry like a little girl? Did you have sex with him? Sure. That's how I get all my targets. We fucked all night, and then I took him outside, shot him with an M98 from less than three feet away. And then finally, I shoved the rifle up my ass, and that's why you can't find it. So if we're quite done here, I'd like to go retrieve it now. Unless you're actually going to charge me with something. We're talking about Alan Cross here. The guy knows when anyone takes a piss in one of his 87 offices. 92, actually. His expanded Chinese market and all that. We're gonna need an Annie. Two Jeffros, damn good Frankfurt, and possibly a Boxborn Kiss. And two Miss Daisies, one Johnny Boy, and at least three Wild Punches. Plus, of course, more luck than anyone's ever had in the history of the human race. So you are interested. You can take me from behind, slap my ass, but don't even think about putting anything back there. You try the old, whoops, wrong hole, and I swear to God, I will punch you in the face. Okay. Any questions? It might be quite a while. What about the milk? It's four degrees out here. The milk will be fine. Fate.